king here first. Well, if I do that, then he's got check, king up. Okay, well, that actually... No, I don't like that. Because then he gets the e-pawn. So if I take... He doubles up. King over. Check, king here. And if he takes, then I just take back with the king. I should be fine. So I'm just wondering, does he have uh, anything with... Say C5. Don't think so. I think I can just take that. Here, if he plays C5, I think I just take. All right, so I'm go. I'm just going to take that pawn. Let's see if I'm missing anything. Oh, he's got maybe D6. Maybe D6 is his idea. Ah. <clears throat> No, I don't think d6 is, is all that good, actually. I was thinking d6, and then if I take, he takes here with check. But then I could always just play... Yeah, okay, so he's just going to double up. Let's not overcomplicate things, Aaron. Okay, so I have to bring my king over so that I can run away here. He was threatening check, and then my king had to go up here, and then he'd bring the other rook down, and because the pawn is here, my king has no escape. So that was a checkmate threat. So we're going to go down to the wire. Surprise, surprise. Me in time trouble. So now it's a blitz game, essentially. My opponent, the stronger player, has five minutes. I've got 3.30. So I'm going to have to uh, 